we are going to make crawling skin. It's the same recipe as slime. And we're going to put, I have some magnetic primer. I'm just going to take a chunk. So here's white school glue. A good amount of that. I'm going to put this magnetic primer without mixing it. I'm just grabbing a chunk from the bottom. I'm going to let the oils drip off. I want it as oil free as possible. And put a chunk of the solids into the glue. The more you put in, the more magnetic it's going to be, but also the darker the final color. So it's a balancing act here. I want it to be flesh colored. That's all I'm going to put in of the magnetic material. Now I've got powdered yellow and powdered red paint and white tempera paint. I'm putting some white tempera paint in because I want it to lighten up the dark. I'm going to put uh, what teaspoon of yellow iron oxide. It's not magnetic, it's just uh, color. And about a quarter teaspoon of the red. And we're just going to stir that around. What do I have for stirring? The end of a brush. Adding more white and it's too red, so I'm adding more yellow. And this is just eyeballing it. I don't have a recipe for how much color to add. I just keep mixing it until I get a flesh color. So I'm adding more yellow. And it is pretty close to flesh colored. Okay, I'm happy with that. Now, I don't want it to be thick like silly putty. I want it to be slimy. So I'm going to add some water. Cold water, about equal amounts. Maybe not equal amounts, maybe less. because I also have to add more water when I add borax. I have in here a quarter cup of water and I'm adding uh, about a tablespoon of borax to that and then I'm going to mix it with my fingers to dissolve the lumps Okay, 
get that stirred, get this stirred. Stir really well right before combining the two. So you can keep the solid, the iron solids suspended in the liquid. Okay, here goes. Wait a little while. Start moving it. You've got uh, magnetic slime, skin colored. We shall have to test that out. And then I'll drain out the excess liquid. 